Looks like we have a Gibson R0. R0. Yeah, it's the 1960 uh, reissue. It's got the thinner neck on it. Oh, it's so comfy. Yeah. It really is just a comfy, comfy thing. And this one's got some uh, kind of high output stuff going on in yeah. the. Now that you guys have heard Guy play this one, let's uh, get up close and check out the condition. Gave this one a 7.5 out of 10. It's in good shape. Uh, it's got some scratches, dings, some wear on the back, and then it has a very, very well done headstock repair that we'll get up close and check out. All right, let's check it out. Just a tiny bit of tarnish on that hardware. Uh, I mean, overall, the top looks pretty good. Some light dings. Let's get in there and you can kind of see if we shine that light in there, you'll be able to see some smaller dings. Oh, there's one. Get in there real slow. I mean, overall, the top looks really good. I'm not really seeing a ton going on. Looks like it's been refretted. Refret looks great. Uh, rosewood fingerboard. There's no wear on these frets. They're nice and clean. From the headstock, just light scratches, but overall, I mean, it looks really, really good. I'll get this thing flipped over. <laughs> And there's our serial number 02232, 2002 RO. There's our headstock. It's really hard to tell that there's a repair in there, but there is a repair. It was done really, really well. You can see it uh, right along there. Looks like they just uh, spliced a piece of wood in there, and they even did a really good job of matching up the grain pattern. We didn't do this repair, but um, you almost can't even tell it's there. It's that good. Okay. Back of the neck looks good. Let's get the back of the body. Oh, there we go. We've got our buckle wire back there that you can see. Not as bad as I'm making it look, but it's definitely there. And it's not, uh, uh, how do I put this? It's not like it's not there. It's there. It just... It looks a lot worse in the photos. It would just look more kind of like that and real, like if you're actually looking at it without shining the light. But once you get that light shined on there, you can start to see all that pop out more. Yeah. We'll 
go over that some more. Let's get that off here so you can see the rest of it. All right, well, there you have it on that one.